Hey guys, in this video, let's do the unboxing and review of this audio cooler brand uh, M71 digital player. This is the box. Now let's have a look on the unboxing. And this package is a review unit from Concept Con. And but the views are mine. So now in the box, firstly you'll get the digital audio player, and then there is a normal earphone is given. So you can use this earphone also. The quality is uh, decent good. And then you'll get a 3.5 to 3.5 jack. You can use this cable for uh, connecting on any headphones like that. And then there is a Type C to Type A cable is given. Using this cable, you need to transfer any audio files uh, to this digital player from from your PC and also using this cable you can charge this digital player then finally there is a user manual so now firstly let's have a look on the design and overview features of this digital audio player now this digital player firstly comes in very compact in size it is very compact and small in size and but the weight it has some very good decent amount of weight and at the back side here is the audio cooler branding is given firstly to turn on this player so here is a power key just a press and hold continuously so now it actually boots up you can see the audio cooler has been shown now this is how the home screen is actually looks like it has the 2.4 inch lcd panel display and it supports the 240 to 320 pixel resolution and it's a lcd panel so the touch response is normal so you not expect a more uh, as like in the modern android phones so the touch response is a decent good and in this digital player at the right side here is a power key and it is also the wake up key whenever you single press the screen will off and again single press the screen Screen will awake and then here is a speaker is grill is also given when you play any song you can use this digital player as a loudspeaker also and then at the top dual 3.5 jack is given you can connect any 3.5 jack headphones iems or any speakers also and on the left side here is the sd card support given by default in this uh, digital player there is an inbuilt 32 gb of a memory but in addition if you want you can uh, you can extend to up to 120 gb using the sd card but with the help of the 32 gb uh, internal memory itself you can load more than 500 songs in this digital audio player and on the front here is a previous button and then next is a track switching button and here is a volume slider you can increase or decrease the volume using this volume slider now let's move on to the other settings and features option now in this digital player so here is a uh, all the applications so firstly there is a music app video pictures fm radio it's supported and here's a bluetooth connection and uh, recordings you can record the audio also it has an inbuilt microphone so you can record audio if you want and there is a step calculator also so once you click on the step you can uh, track your steps also and here is a ebook you can read any text format uh, ebooks and then here is a folder view it's called a file manager then there is a stopwatch alarm and wallpaper once you click on that you can change the home screen wallpaper whenever you click the wallpaper will change and then there is a settings option in the settings you can see the language option display settings sleep timer power of timer date and time so you can you want to change the date and time on initially and on the display settings you can change the screen saver so here is a screen saver background if you want whatever screen saver you can select it from uh, 11 different wallpapers and here is a screen saver on and off better turn off the screen saver for long playback hours but in the screen saver you can select the digital clock then whenever you turn off the screen and again wake up the screen you can see the screen saver and here there is a clock date and day is uh, displayed and once you swipe up it will be unlocked so overall these are all some extra features now moving on to the connection so it's supported with the dual connection like uh, you can connect it to wired and wireless at the same time for example at the top there is a two headphone jack uh, 3.5 jack support so you can connect the two iems also or any uh, wired any 3.5 jack speakers or any headphones or uh, wired earphones so you can connect the two uh, devices at the same time and if you play any audio in both these devices the audio will stream at the same time and also it supported with the bluetooth connection also once you click on the bluetooth you can enable the bluetooth and you can pair any bluetooth devices like a tws earbuds bluetooth speakers any bluetooth headphones neck bands so like that whatever you want you can connect any bluetooth devices i checked on with the oneplus Nord buds 3 pro and a beats solar buds realme buds r6 
so i connected all these tws earbuds which are all really works out good and main thing is that during streaming the wired headphones also you can stream the bluetooth uh, headphones as well at the same time which means overall you can stream up to three devices at the same time simultaneously using this audio cooler m71 digital player and uh, moving on to the battery performance so for charging it takes maximum three hours it has four level of uh, battery indication so to complete the first point to fourth point it takes maximum three hours and the playback hours will actually differs based on the volume and how many devices you connect and uh, what type of connection you are using whether wired or wireless i checked on the wired connection so i used it to connect with the only single uh, earphone wired earphones and i used to hear at a 15 50 percent volume and in this digital player the volume level is comes with up to 31 point i listen at a 15 point level of volume to check the playback hours when i checking the playback hours it actually gives the long playback hours of around 48 hours of a continuous playback so when i using with the only with the single uh, 3.5 jack uh, wired earphones it has a long playback hours if you are traveling for a long journey like that means so this digital audio player is really helpful for you and also when hearing the music turn off the screen because if the screen is always on means then the playback hours will be less so always turn off the screen during uh, you are listening to the music now next uh, moving on to the some music experience so firstly it's supported with a lot of audio format it's supported with the mp3 wave f flag asc formats mostly try to use the f flag format audio songs because that have the high bitrate you will get a more detailed sound experience when you use the f flag format songs so try to download the f flag format songs in the online or wherever the official site is available so try to get that f flag format songs you can search it on the google or in the telegram like that and then uh, then move that f flag format songs to this digital player using this uh, type c connection um, using this type c port you can transfer it from your pc or there is a sd card support you can insert the sd card in your android phone and uh, transfer the files and then use that sd card in this digital player to stream the audio now on the music experience i just started using the iem with the uh, uh, mobile phones with the 3.5 jack and i listen to some i listen with some songs and after that i use the same iem in this digital audio player and i use it to hear that same set of songs then what i feel the difference is that the firstly on the overall volume when using on the digital audio player the overall volume is actually boosted and it is also having a very detailed lower frequency sounds and also it's a very well balanced because of that overall volume increase you can able to feel good effects on your uh, iems as well when compared to connecting on mobile phones in the digital audio player the overall volume is boosted well and it's a very detailed and you'll get a very good music experience it almost uh, reflects the originality on your uh, music experience and also based on the iems you connect so you can able to feel the distortion because in some iems if you have the less uh, input impedance means then you need to listen at a very lower volume only and it almost similar to the dac but it not more good as like uh, when connecting on the digital to analog converter a separate portable DAC but it's almost near to that performance uh, when connecting any 3.5 mm type of IEMs on this audio cooler digital player now let me share the uses of this digital audio player and in what cases uh, this digital audio player will be useful for you so now first case is that if you are a music lover and if you want to experience a true sound experience then this type of digital audio player will be helpful for you and also it's a very portable so you no need any apps or any internet connection so you can use it anywhere anytime your you can listen to your favorite songs in more detailed and the most important thing is that load a flag format of songs for better experience then this product is really useful for older pupils and uh, your parents and users who using only keypad based uh, mobiles like that means they can use a separate source like this digital player to experience the music let's say if your parents going in a, any outdoor for long uh, trip like that means during that time uh, this type of digital players helps for a, a good time pause by listening your favorite uh, song and third one is that uh, so this uh, digital uh, audio cooler digital player has a higher output impedance it's supported with 32 ohms this type of player is really uh, good for high-end headphones so most of the headphones 
ohms is comes with the input impedance of uh, 32 ohms and most of the iems are also comes with the uh, input impedance of 32 ohms and uh, many high end speakers which are all comes with the high input impedance if the any audio product having high input impedance means then that type of audio product need more uh, power uh, from the source so if you connect uh, like that iems or any headphones directly on the phone smartphones means because generally most of the smartphones comes with a single digit of output impedance if the impedance not match with the audio product then the experience will be minimal only so im impedance matching with the audio source and the audio product is very important for a best experience so in that way if you use any high-end headphones uh, or any speakers soundbar so if that audio products with a 3.5 jack means when connecting on like this uh, digital players so then like that audio products will deliver more good sound quality and an extra during the flood time so during the time there will be no power no internet in that situation so like this audio color digital player will helps you to listen your favorite songs then finally so like this digital players will uh, helps for the iphone users because in iphones there is a no 3.5 jack or a, a type c port and in most iems is actually coming only on the 3.5 jack but if you are an iphone user getting a separate digital player like this will really helps you to listen good music so now overall these are all the uh, things i find out on the uses of this uh, audio cooler uh, digital player and a few cons i feel on this audio cooler uh, digital player is that uh, there is a no dedicated play pause button on this player so every time you if you want to play pause you have to wake up the screen and in the now playing section you need to play or pause it from the touch screen and the next during screen off you can't able to switch to previous track or next track or you can't able to increase or decrease the volume so to do all this function you have to again uh, wake up the screen during that time only the volume control next track previous track will actually work if this actually support uh, during the screen off condition also and uh, if there is a dedicated play pause button means then the user experience is much more better so well now this is my review of this audio cooler digital player and the product link in the description it cost around 2500 well that's it on this video guys and if you like this video hit the like and subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching this video guys